second satellite in the Navy's new mobile communications network is set to launch into orbit July 19th. The Mobile User Objective System, or MUOS satellite, is a system that uses commercial 3G cell phone technology to provide communication services to mobile military troops. The Assistant Program Manager, Commander Matt Bolin, explains the timeline of the program. So MUOS 2 sort of represents the penultimate uh, moment in the development of the MUOS program in the sense that not only are we launching the second satellite, but um, the ground system, the networking uh, software, and the waveform are all being delivered within the next couple months. So with MUOS 2 on orbit this fall, we will be testing the full MUOS system uh, with all of the new capabilities that it brings, and then that will be delivered to the warfighter next summer. MUOS works like a cell tower to serve ships, submarines, aircraft, and land terminals that the military use to communicate. Once the system is complete in 2017, it will provide coverage to mobile military communications like never before, and users will benefit from the system in many ways. Over the current UHF legacy system, the user is going to notice um, more bandwidth that's accessible on demand as opposed to pre-planning the channels, uh, better voice quality, simultaneous voice and data, um, better connectivity in, in remote regions uh, while they're on the move, in urban environments, um, in the weather. Um, so it should be a great revolutionary leap for uh, UHF satellite communications for the DOD. To learn more about the MUO satellite program, visit public.navy.mil spaywar. From the Defense Media Activity, I'm Petty Officer Andrew Johnson. <laughs>